Today's morning coffee's coming from uh, a hire car. I'm going to see a friend. Um, so I've hired this wonderful black Corsa for the day. Um, and a bit of a treat. We're having a McDonald's coffee instead of my usual morning coffee. Um, so I've got to go and drive, go and see my buddy. Um, I haven't seen him for at least a year. So I'm really looking forward to that. Um, but I had to pull over and get started on my bacon sandwich and my coffee first. So there we go. Uh, I put something up on Instagram and I put a poll up on Twitter. Uh, I'm just curious if anyone would like to see any cheaper products uh, coming up. I know we've started out with the products we've got. I understand uh, that they've got a bit of a price tag. I also understand that people um, responded to a recent poll we did most people are spending a thousand or more on wine a year uh which stands to reason it's only 83 pounds a month um which uh when you figure that back in uh, like a bottle a day it's probably not it could be you could be spending a thousand uh, um having a bottle a day uh but that, you're probably looking at like some uh you know low-end pino for that uh for that kind of price so um that's a tough one uh, but if you're buying decent wine, eight, nine, ten, fifteen a bottle, um, thousand a year sounds sounds about right. You, you're probably not drinking a bottle every night. Maybe having two, maybe three in a week, or maybe four max, uh, depending on what you're buying, how you're buying it. Um, so that's an interesting uh, setup. But do we need to have some cheaper products in there? Uh, do we do we need to be rolling something? Um, I'm also curious as to how we would do if we did like a collections uh, thing. So the collections thing is, um, in my mind, we could put a whole load of Pinot Noir together. So we could put a box of four Pinot Noir or a box of four, um, I don't know what else we could do. Um, we could just pick, you know, a box of four Chardonnay, for example. I'm just trying to give some white red balance for, for the white readers, listeners, watchers. Um... I'm just wondering if maybe a collections thing might be a good idea. We could probably bring the price down on that as a result. Um, lastly, I'm looking at these uh, these uh, tip availability um, things. So uh, I've offered it to the street team yesterday. They've got a phenomenal offer and some super, super cheap um, stuff, uh, which I'm going to sell at cost. But there's an opportunity or, or an option uh, when you get the invoice to add a tip. So I'm not making any money out of it. Um, if they decide to just order the wine and pay for the delivery, then they're just paying for the wine and the delivery. Um, but there's an option to, to add a tip if they want to add a tip. Um, and that's whatever they think they should pay us for putting the whole thing together. Um, I'm kind of excited to see how that pans out. Firstly, to see if anyone actually orders any. No, wrong car. Uh, firstly, to see if anyone actually orders any. Um, secondly, uh, to um, some guy just try to get in the car. I'm trying to like carry it off as if it didn't happen, but it did. Some guy just try to get in the car. Um, as I've lost my train of thought, I'm gonna have to stay there. Guys distracted me, trying to <laughs> trying to get in. That was really funny. Um, okay, so. Uh, Hope everyone has a great day. I'm going to go and hang with my friend because I haven't seen him for so long. Uh, we're going to drink coffee, put the world to rights, um, and the chances are we'll probably try and start a business because that tends to be what happens when we hang out. Um, and then I'm going to go home. I'm going to train. Um, I did a bleep test yesterday. I'm going to do another one today. I'm going to be obsessed with the bleep tests for the next couple of weeks, so get ready for that. Um, I'm just going to try and demolish one. And that's about it. Have a good day, everybody.